hey guys welcome to my channel in this video i show you an easier way of making an animated subscribe button and how to add it as a gif or gif on your videos using the inshot app start by editing your youtube channel photo using the inshot app just select your photo from the gallery then add a frame on it uh, the circle frame we are trying to replicate what is usually on youtube and that's why we are adding the circle frame so enlarge it and fit it into the frame then save the photo and click on the video option on the video option add a blank image and adjust the duration to about five to six seconds then change the back background color to white Click on the sticker option to add your YouTube channel photo that we've just edited. It will lead you to your gallery. Then you can select the image and crop it as needed. Fit it into the middle so that it will guide you with the other stickers. Once you're done with that, click on add text and add the YouTube channel name and the number of subscribers on your channel. The number of subscribers is optional. You can leave it out, but we are just trying to replicate what is on YouTube. So add your channel name and add the number of subscribers of your channel. Try to fit this into the middle also as you, as you put it next to the YouTube channel image. I actually have a similar video on how to make an animated subscribe button. But in that video, we couldn't add it as a GIF because InShot had not updated its app. But with the latest updates, we can add GIFs on our videos. And that is why I'm doing another tutorial on this. The next step is to make a subscribe button. And I use the text option to do this. So I just typed subscribe. And then I'm going to add it onto the video. Then I'm also going to type subscribed, which will be next to subscribe. And this will, there will be a changing effect as the video plays. I'm going to place the subscribed text immediately after the subscribe. I ensure that both texts have the same font size as I, pl as I place them onto the video. As you're watching this video, subscribe to my channel for more tutorials and for media updates, tips, and tricks. So once I have fitted the subscribed text into the video, I'm now going to add the bell icons. For the bell icons, I downloaded them from Google. You can just search for free PNG bell icons and pick the ones that are non-copyright. I'm also going to resize the bell and place it next to the subscribe icon. For a changing effect, I downloaded two bells, one in black and one in gray. So once the black is clicked on, it will change to gray. So I'm going to add two bells and the other gray one will be next to the subscribed text. As I continue to add more text and stickers, I'll be making adjustments to ensure there's a smooth transition in the animation. So the next step is to add the cursor, the cursor icon. And for this, I just clicked on the sticker. Then I clicked on GIF and search for a cursor. With the latest InShot update, you can find GIFs and stickers under the sticker icon. Now I'm going to resize the cursor icon, place one on the subscribe text and place the other on the bell icon. Thank you. 
Once I'm satisfied with how the animation looks, I will now save this animated video and the next step is to convert it into a GIF or GIF. To convert this video into a GIF, I tried many apps such as Unscreen, Convertio, the Jiffy app, but all of them reduced the quality of the video, so I ended up using Canva. With the Canva app, it's easier to do it on your PC than on your phone. So I just started by searching for a banner design because of the banner size. The other option is to create a design with the accurate number of pixels. I was not sure about this and this is why I picked a banner design. I'm just going to delete everything on this design because I need the blank space only. And I'm also going to change it into white. By now you've transferred your animated video from your phone to your PC and the next step is to upload it on Canva. Once you've uploaded it on Canva, you place it on the banner design. Add the subscribe animation on your banner design, then resize it as needed. Once you're done, confirm that your animated video is okay, then click on download. Under the download, click on the option of GIF. Download your animated video as a GIF. By the way, this is the Canva free version. You can convert your MP4 video into a GIF for free. Also, there will be no watermark on your animation, and this is why I preferred Canva over the other apps. Once the download is complete, transfer your GIF to your phone. Now I'm going to show you how to add the subscribe animation on your video without green screen or chroma key. Here is a sample video that I'm supposed to upload on YouTube. To add the subscribe animation, click on the sticker icon, then click on the image icon, then click on the plus which will lead you to your gallery and pick your GIF. Your GIF will appear on your video and you can resize it as needed. You can also place it anywhere on the video. This is the easiest way of adding a custom subscribe animation on your videos using the InShot app on your phone. Go ahead and try it out. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up.